Aldehydes are organic compounds that contain a formyl functional group. The formyl functional group is a carbon that is double bonded to an oxygen and single bonded to a hydrogen and then single bonded to the rest of a carbon chain. Now any compound that contains this formyl group is called an aldehyde and therefore gets the suffix anel. Now what we can see what is unique about this formyl group is that since it only allows the carbon chain to extend in one direction, we do not need to indicate the position of that formyl functional group. So we would name a compound by counting the number of carbons in the longest chain, in this case meth eth propbut, and we would then say that since it contains this formyl functional group, it is an aldehyde and therefore gets the suffix anel, and so we would call this butanol. It is unnecessary to call it butan-1-L because aldehydes with a formyl group are always on the first carbon. We can see this with a slightly more complicated molecule, where here we identify once again our longest carbon chain. It was also possible to identify this as the longest chain, but what that would then do is create a branch that has a branch off it, and that is unnecessarily complicated for us, so we choose the longest carbon chain possible. We therefore see that this is five carbons and therefore pent. We can see that it contains the formyl group and therefore must be pentanel. And then what we do is, in the same way as we always would, we name the alkyl branches. Here we can see that there are three carbons attached to the main chain. Note here that the fact that it bends does not affect the way in which we name it, it is still three carbons. Three carbons gets the prefix prop and prop -il because it is a branch. And here we have a methyl branch. And now because this is an aldehyde, this is automatically carbon number one. And as a result, the propyl branch must be on carbon number two and the methyl branch on carbon number three. And so alphabetically, we would call this three methyl. 2-propyl pentanol. Once again, this is all one word.